For WNEM TV 5 News Update. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Meg McLeod. Here's a quick look at the top stories we're following this afternoon. A former Genesee County priest sentenced to a year in jail and probation for sexually assaulting a child decades ago. In April, 84 year old Vincent D. Lorenzo pleaded guilty to first degree criminal sexual conduct after sexually assaulting a five year old boy following a funeral service that he officiated for the boy's family in 1987. Court records show D. Lorenzo will serve the first year of his sentence at the Genesee County Jail with 39 days already served, as well as five years probation, paying fines, and registering as a sex offender. Two weeks ago, Someone had broke in sometime through the middle of the night um, and they stole everything. A restaurant ransacked just weeks away from opening. David Young, owner of Nacho Foods, says someone broke into their new location in Birch Run Township and stole more than $30,000 worth of equipment. He says the community support has been the biggest blessing, saying they received so many donations, they've almost replaced everything that was stolen. Despite that, the new location of Nacho Pizza is still set to open sometime next month. A sewer improvement project in Midland is causing single lane closures in both directions on Saginaw Road this week. The lane closures start Thursday from Sturgeon Avenue to Dublin Avenue. One lane in each direction will be shifted. Saginaw Road will close to through traffic at the Main Street intersection Friday, June 23rd at 8 p.m. Traffic will be detoured to Dublin Avenue. Wackerly Street and Sturgeon Avenue. Saginaw Road will reopen to through traffic at 12 p.m. on Saturday, June 24th. Construction is anticipated to be completed in mid-July, weather permitting.